So, coming to you guys with some immediate breaking news. It seems that Kim and Kanye are now getting a divorce. Hey guys, it's Marad Marad. Hope you guys are doing well today. Back again with another video. If you haven't subscribed, guys, click that button. Even on my damn birthday, this is my fifth video on my birthday that I'm coming to you guys and continuously dedicate to you guys. Subscribe and click that button for daily and consistent content. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Let's get into this, guys, and not waste any more time. So, this has now been announced exclusively via Page Six, and we know that page six come through exclusively with their stuff they have their sources they've been legit here and there and even the new york post everywhere is now you know posting this and kanye is currently trending number one and this is what is happening so it's now been announced that kim kardashian and kanye will start over multiple sources tell page six that divorce is imminent for the hollywood couple with with kardashian hiring divorce attorney to the stars of laurel wessner they are keeping it low-key but they are done says the source kim has hired laurel wesser and they are in settlement talks Kim, 40, has not been wearing her wedding ring and Kanye, 43, remained at his $14 million Wyoming ranch over the holidays instead of spending it with the Kardashians. Kim got Kanye to go up there to Wyoming so they could live separate lives and quietly get things sorted out to separate and divorce. She is done. The source added that while Kim has done much in the past to protect and help Kanye deal with his mental health struggles, now this divorce is happening because Kim has grown up a lot. She is serious about taking the bar exam and becoming a lawyer. She is serious about her prison reform campaign. Meanwhile, Kanye is talking about running for president and says other crazy sh and she's had enough of it. Meanwhile, a separate source says Kanye, who has become increasingly uncomfortable and irritated by the Kardashians over the top reality TV star lives, is completely over the entire family. He wants nothing to do with them, added he eventually found their reality show unbearable. Kanye West tweeted in July, I've been trying to get divorced since Kim met with Meek at the ward off for prison reform, seeming to refer to a criminal justice summit, um, summit attended by Kim and rapper Meek. He also called Mama Jo Christiana Chris John Un and claimed that the Kardashians were trying to force him into a psychiatric treatment. Then Kanye reluctantly showed up for Kim's ridiculously extravagant $1 million plus 40th birthday in Tahiti last October. He showed up late and left early. He wouldn't appear in any of the Instagram shots. All he did was bring over the hologram of her father, Robert then got out of there as fast as he could, the source added. The source said the biggest sticking point in the Kimye divorce settlement talks could be over the Calabasas California family home, which underwent a total redesign masterminded by Kanye and was heralded by an architectural digest as an oasis of purity and light. The source says Kim is trying to get Kanye to turn over the Calabasas home to her because that's where the kids are based and growing up. That is their home. She owns all the land and adjoining lot around the house, but Kanye owns the actual house. They both put a lot of money into renovating it. The source added of the advance you know, talks, this isn't the first time they've been talking about a split, but this time it is way more serious. Another source confirmed to us that the divorce settlement talks were underway, but they were not yet at the point of deciding how their properties would be divided. This would be Kim's third divorce. This is some shady article. Um, so this is basically what it is. It's trending everywhere. Everyone is talking about it. The divorce, divorce is now imminent. And you know, this is basically what is happening. Now granted, this is tea, this is discussion, this is conversation. However, let's take this with, with some seriousness, guys, because there is there are children involved in this and they will be impacted by this. But guys, I think I can speak for everybody when I say, I think I can speak for everybody. I think I can really speak for everybody, guys, when I really tell you guys that this is, this is something that we all saw. This is something that I feel we, this is something that I feel like we, we all knew this was coming. Do you understand? And people don't, I've been saying this from the day one, there have been weird reports. People were confirming this, they weren't confirming this, and it was a little bit weird. But Kanye is now, Kanye is now somebody who, you know, completely detests these Kardashians, but you were very up with them on the peak of their reality show lives. So that in itself is a bit confusing to me, but they did go through a major situation back in July, and when there is smoke, there is fire. Somebody has lit the damn match, and now somebody's putting it out. All I can say to you guys is Taco Bell is calling, and it's a wrap. Do you understand? Taco Bell is calling, and it is a wrap. It is what it is. They're getting a divorce. I feel like this is confirmed. It's everyday source, source, source. They never name these sources. I think that's just how the business works. But at the same time, I just feel sorry for the kids. I feel like this is a serious topic and I just feel sorry for them. But everyone's talking about it, it's tweeting everyone, trending everywhere, New York Post, page six, all has come out now, breaking news in the last 15 minutes. And I thought I'd have to get a video out to you guys because of course I was covering this back forth. But what are your thoughts when it comes to this? What are your thoughts? Because I think we all saw it coming. 
but now they're gonna be over this home. This Calabasas home, and the things can get very ugly between them, and perhaps Kanye might spiral out of control again, perhaps he will say things, and it could get worse. Perhaps he will say something, we don't know. And like you like before, that, you know, being forced into hospital, you know, um, Kim and Meek were doing stuff, I'm sick of Kris Jenner. That was a lot of stuff that was coming out, and suddenly it's all gone quiet. So will he come out again? I don't know, guys, but we have to obviously just wait and see how this unfolds. But there were a lot of fake reports and then apparently there were pictures of them together and they were all great together and everything was fine. But was that all damage control? Because apparently at Kim's birthday, he was there for a minute and jumped out and did nothing. Maybe that Robert hologram was all for image. Who knows guys, who really cares? But at the same time, it's trending everywhere. I thought I'd get a video, video out to you guys as soon as possible. Let me know your thoughts on when it comes to this. So subscribe to the channel. Click that button guys for daily and consistent content. Click that button, do you understand? Click that button and subscribe to the damn channel. I'd appreciate it. Let me not be rude. And I'll catch you guys soon for another video. Stay safe, stay blessed. And yeah, I'll see you guys soon. Mm.